like every first year show kind of goes through a process that they're trying to find their self and find yeah. their voice, especially mythology shows. So what do you kind of feel like was the biggest lesson you learned in making the first 10 episodes? Uh, I think we kept things a little too simple and straightforward and I don't think we really advanced it fast enough. I think our scope was a little... I was maybe a little overly cautious with how we progressed things because it was a new world and I wanted to make sure that it was just a nice IV trip of explaining to people uh, what it was all about. But people caught on fast and they're smart. And uh, and then I think we found with, you know, sort of in the run that as even I was watching as a viewer, I felt a certain impatience. I said, all right, I'm ready for the story to go now. Uh, and so I think the thing we really learned was, you know, when I, you know, I just said to all the writers who are awesome, I just said, you know, we just got to blow the doors off it. We got to just start burning through the story. We got to start getting to the cool reveals. We got to just start getting to the awesome moments. Um, and we just have to, we just got to, you know, make it bigger and better. And, and now that we've explained the world to the audience, like now it's time to really give it some scope and, and some drama. Well, it's fascinating you say that because I feel like the first 10 were kind of building up to, you know, finding Danny and finding Miles and Monroe. And as an audience, we had that to look forward to. Right. And now we're kind of, we don't know necessarily what our ultimate goals should be. So. All will be clear. Yeah. Tune in for episode 11. Yes. Uh, what I will say to anyone who's a fan of the show uh, or anyone who's interested in the show in the first half, like, give me episode 11. Mm -hmm. Like, and 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 if that doesn't draw you in, then 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 I don't know then I don't know what to, what to say because I, I think we, we really reset what this war is going to be. Our heroes are really going to be very very focused in an unexpected way uh, to put all of their forces against Monroe, and then it becomes you know if the the first half of the season was find Danny, the second half of the season is stop Monroe. You know, basically defeat the Empire. And and then and, and so then the, the revolution really begins in earnest in a way that I think is really emotionally explosive. And uh, and so I think, you know, I think people will be I think people will be blown away by it. Is Miles gonna be upfront about the fact that he had the chance to do something with Monroe and didn't take it? Yeah, no, I think I think that's the thing. I think I think they're brothers and they have great love for each other. And and I feel like that's what makes their uh, that, that's what I feel makes their relationship so interesting because they're actually closer as characters. Miles is closer to Monroe than he is to any other character in the show, but that's the guy he has to defeat. So that's really complicated and really interesting drama, I think.